Good morning everybody. Now few tips for the parents why I've chosen this. Is this book, the books that I've chosen are one from the Panchatantra series and some other interesting books. But moreover is because these books have a very large font size and which is what I really like, you know. And what I've done is I've scanned the entire book so you can see the book. Maybe you can ask your child to read it. And if not, and if your child is very lazy and you have something else to do, but you want to keep your child busy, this is it. Just tell them to sit in front of this video and listen to my story. So it's all about storytelling and what fun. So my first book that I've chosen is The Lake of the Moon. There was a huge lake in the middle of a dense jungle. A large colony of rabbits lived near the pond. One day, a big herd of elephants came dashing to the lake for water. On their way, they trampled and injured a lot of rabbits. The rabbits were really worried. One clever rabbit suggested, Send me to the elephant king. I will work out a plan and save our family. He was sent to the elephant king. One evening, the clever rabbit saw the elephants resting happily. He went up to the tusker king and climbed up a huge rock and shouted, Your Majesty, I am the messenger of the moon god, the master of the lake. He has a message for you. The elephant king was surprised. He said, read the moon god's message for us. The rabbit read out. O oh, the king of elephants, you have annoyed me by soiling the holy lake, my holy lake. And you have killed many rabbits who are under my protection. Rabbit then took the elephant king to the lake. The elephant saw the reflection of the moon in the water and touched the water with its trunk. The water was disturbed and the reflection of moon seemed to shake in fury. The king elephant was scared. We will leave the pond immediately and not make the moon god angry, he said. The rabbits were now safe. I hope you've enjoyed this story and if you want to listen to it again, just rewind it and we will wait for my next story. See you next time. Thank you so much. I hope you've enjoyed this video. See you. Bye bye.